<laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Okay, I gotta do this, this one more thing now. <laughs> I'm the only being dumb enough to do that. And now Grand Mayor! He's not human. You just get the runs if you hear us anyways, got it fools? <laughs> Whoa, so the whole town's decided to show their true selves, have they? Uh oh, stinky. So I can see a plot, is this a village what it looks like? Yeah, it's what we left after the demons devoured the humans. Careful, I think they mean business this time. I see nothing wrong. Earth, wind, fire, and air. We make love because we don't care. That, that's the Hex Girl song, right? Oh, yeah. So far, I've been pretty efficient in the fights, but if anyone goes crazy, which it's usually Alice because she has no sanity points, things get a little bonkers. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> bonkers. Yes. Well, cause they, they give the protagonist so much SP cause he uses so much of it to fuse. She run up, bonk, bonk their snoot. <laughs> oh. Hey, how do you get in? Oh wait, she's Yoda now. Get in here, how did? H have you done with my beloved children, what have? Hey lady, I put the kitties to sleep permanently. And that's kitties with a TT, cause they're cats. Why don't you show us your true form too? We're tired of this endless procession of fiends. We figured if we came here and took care of you, well, you know how it always works. <laughs> Fools. Even. I don't even know how to do that as a Yoda thing. 
the monsters will remain. Remain, even if I die. <laughs> Still be in prisons, you will be in this town. <laughs> because of all this, the will of Great Yamaraja, protector of village. Yamaraja, come on. I could take care of by destroying the shrine back there. Take a look. These are the bones. Bones these are. Of all the things I've sacrificed to him. Use the malice I have of people. And made this fence to keep it all away from here. As long as I'm alive. As long as alive I am. This fence will protect Yamaraja. This <laughs> is out killing me. Can't you get near the shrine? You can't. <laughs> My Yoda bad right now. So I was right after all. You are the one whose ass I got kick. You have to catch me, you will. Poof. Gone. Where'd that demon cat go? Funny joke. Teleports away. <laughs> Going to wander aimlessly through this village, you will. Whether it die never comes. <laughs> Damn it, I'll skin your hide. Well, I mean, this does kind of look like Dagobah. And Alice is in white and blue, like R2. And I look at Yuri, he is a young upstart, young protagonist. This is, this is just like Star Wars. Yeah, she must be somewhere in this village. Let's find her. Oh, you know you love Ooey Ooey Oo. Oh, I'm sorry, they're stinky snail boys, not stinky frog boys. Yeah, I'd be confused too if a tiny little snail man jumped up and slapped me with his ass. Fine! <laughs> I I do the same thing whenever I get hit by some weird I'm just like, FINE! <laughs> yuck yuck yuck! <laughs> y Yoda laughs are dangerously close to horse sounds. It'd be easier to just give up and let us eat you, don't you think? Oof. At this rate, it's just the same thing over and over again. I'm not getting anywhere. I won't learn anything with the blast shield down. <laughs> well, well. Ah! This is the reverse seal of Tian Bang, all right. The mark of Dua Hai. But he was supposed to have lost his powers 15 years ago. Surely it can't be that he's... Who's that with you? An elder munchkin? Well, well. Still people here, eh? This guy. This... This guy! Stand aside! I'm gonna punch the door. Ah, it won't open. It's a pool door! You're supposed to pull it, you dingus! <laughs> a pu pool! <laughs> Unfortunately, you won't be able to leave. See this? What's that? You mean the... Wind of heaven business you were talking about? In this country's language, it means you can't leave, right? The quack oracle is not a gremlin. The gay, the gay weapon improver might be, though. <laughs> yeah, it, that's about the size of it. Excuse me! How you been getting here? Through here, we just pushed the gate open. Would it appear that anyone is free to enter? We got in, but it looks like we can't get back out. Ugh. I hate this, I hate it. I see! <laughs> we 
Was that like you're you're making a Gremlins one reference, but like specifically, is it a reference to like ghost stories referencing Gremlins or something? And you are. Ha <laughs> You want to know who I am? Oh, most popular girls. Is oh right, uh, fucking uh. I give everyone a blowjee. <laughs> Whatever that girl is. <laughs> the little one, like, they talk like this. <laughs> well, now you trust the Quack Oracle's voice. I get two rulers and I have it. <laughs> the absolute sage. Master Susan. <laughs> Among exorcists and spirit healers, I am quite well known. There are many adepts in this world. Boy, I will do that kind of work by the hour of day. I was hired by the elders in the neighboring village to come investigate this place tonight. Jesus. An active for half of the day? That's quite unique. This guy's weird, all right, but he's invaluable to me. For all the great jobs he brings in. But well, wait, handsome. Don't you want to know who I am? Hey, hey, hey! Lay off! It's just, uh, you scared customers away! Sorry about that kid! This fellow here is a top notch acupuncturist! <laughs> just gotta, like, triple the size of my tongue while I talk with this character. Even brand new weapons feel like they've been yours for 10 years once he's worked on them. The only problem is you have to learn to pull up with certain predilections he has. He's right. I can't fight, but you'll love the way I assist. Do you have any other ex besides an odd couple? Do you do our town? Let's hit it, Alice. We can find our own way out. Now hold on a second, kids. You too, honey. I'm Yuri. This is Alice. What is it now, Pops? I am I, your spirit kid. No matter how much you walk, you'll never get out of the village the way you're going. What's that supposed to mean? That's a kind of mysterious mark here, isn't it, Susan? Aha! She's a smart one! Exactly! God damn it, why is the exposition machine gotta have this voice? Exactly! This field's power separates the village from the SA will. God, I'm like spitting all over myself. The field itself is just like the little pot. This one has a lock that needs to be open. How can we open this lock? Why would you break the seal? That's right, you get the idea. Now listen carefully, both of you. So this village must be key to the seal. Must finally defeat this person. Well, as I say, Zuri is the destination, so I'm coming along to see if I can help out. What a pain. I'm no good at fighting. I'll stay here and dodge monsters until you get back. If you want to get the most out of any wooden weapon, come see me. I'll show you its true power. And see, I could pay uh, Mujin money to up to give a weapon a little more oomph. Oh, you're the best! <laughs> I can't do that. The next the next party member has to have a Rouge the Bat character voice. Because it's the exact same character as Rogue the Bat. <laughs> Here again you are. Yeah, Batface the Rogue. Never leave, you will. Yeah, my about his decision, that is. <laughs> oh, get, let me have a big drink of water before I do more of this voice. What you mean, Grammy? Is it the decision of whoever is controlling Yamazara behind the scenes? Who are you? Hehehe. <laughs> I need a depth hired? To exercise the village? So are you ready to say uncle? <laughs> Catch me even you couldn't. Mm -hmm. 
be afraid of you, why would I? Hmm? Poof! Hey, we miss her again. No, I can still feel her presence. She's still hiding somewhere in this house. Guess it's time to apply the secret formula for smoking out cat people. Gets out like a little can opener and a can of tuna, it just starts. <laughs> she just comes crawling out from behind one of these pillars, goes, Meow! Do you have any idea what we should do? That I do. I suppose you know how cats take a catnip? They made it by mixing catnip with a special dye. But this here is something called anti cat powder. Man, these leaves really stink. You're just carrying these around? So that's what that funny smell was. I thought it was just old person stink. Yeah, I get it. That's why Granny hit herself. Right. She probably couldn't even stand the thought of running into me again for having a smell this odor again. It's actually an herbal remedy for stomach aches. But smoke has a powerful effect on cat people. Simply put, ah uh, dang. Uh, but to do that we'll need a metal vessel and a torch. You go find these two things when you bring them back I'll burn the incense in this house. A metal vessel and a torch, right? But he's still gonna be in the party, so why is it like you go get this stuff, I'm gonna I'm gonna hang out here. Uh oh. A metal vessel stained with blood, I wonder what it's used for. I gotta try to pick up the metal vessel, otherwise I just, I guess, like, trip and pick my pick my nose or something. <laughs> okay, I've gathered all the tools. Well, I guess I'll give it a go. Let's see, put the anti-cat powder in the metal vessel, then light it with a torch. Uh oh, stinky! Ah! What is this? Ah! Got you now, old hag. You ready to be skin cat? How dare you? Show you I will. Hmm. In big trouble now, you are. Though. There we go. Ah, oh, nothing special. Got, got a good chunk of wind energy.